Welcome to the Product Design Show. I'm Allison Topperwine. Ergonomics is key to good furniture design, but what happens when you want to slouch or the device you're working with makes you have to twist and contort your body? In this episode, we'll look at how designers at Steelcase got the ergonomics right for their new gesture chair, regardless of whether you're sitting up straight or twisted like a pretzel. I'm Vince Penman. Steelcase's gesture chair represents the pinnacle of seating technology, but the chair's designers didn't arrive at gesture's design by trial and error. Instead, they actively sought out feedback about seating posture from more than 2,000 people across 11 countries. That input helped gestures designers understand how modern technology, like smartphones and tablets, affect the way people want to sit and work. Think about it. When you're seated most of the time, you're not sitting up straight. Maybe sometimes you want to slouch while you look at a tablet, or throw your leg over a chair's arm while peering into your smartphone. Well, ergonomics is the science of designing products to support your body while it moves through these postures. And while that sounds simple, incorporating advanced ergonomics into a seat can lead to extremely complicated designs. To make sure the gesture chair didn't fall into that trap, designers broke the chair's movements down into three core systems, the limbs, the core, and the seat, each of which was their own system. While each of these systems had their own separate range of motion, they were all tied to a central user interface that was intuitive and simple to use. Imagine a typical day at work. You don't stay in one position all day. Sometimes you're in a conference room for a meeting. Other times you're in the boss's office. Maybe later you're working from home. In today's dynamic work environment, designing a chair that can be quickly and easily adjusted is an important part of any advanced office furniture. With that in mind, Steelcase's designers created the Gesture Chair's user interface to be easily accessible, fitting it directly underneath the chair's seat. Two intuitively placed control knobs give any user the ability to adjust the seat depth and seat height to quickly create a perfect fit. Additionally, these controls were designed so a person sitting in the chair gets immediate feedback on whether they've achieved the right fit. Coupling the easy-to-use knob interface with the wide range of motions of the gesture chair gave Steelcase's design team the elements they needed to create a sophisticated and simple solution for the postures involved with working on tablets, smartphones, and laptops. By doing their user research and then applying that knowledge to a streamlined system, Steelcase's designers successfully created a comfortable, welcoming chair for a wide range of postures. The gesture chair is a very cool example of insightful design. We'd like to thank Steelcase crew for giving us the behind the scenes look at gesture and the new science of sitting. This episode is sponsored by PTC. To learn more about PTC Creo and how it can help your team develop products, visit ptc.com slash product slash Creo. And thanks for watching this episode of the Product Design Show. Please give it a like on Facebook, subscribe on YouTube, or give us a rating on iTunes.